don't know who the fuck to trust. This is my friend or my fault. I'm not some exit drug. What's up guys, it's Juan Zuniga, and in this video, like the title says, we're gonna do a massive unboxing. So I've been getting a lot of stuff at home, and I was like, you know what, let's do a video on this. I have a lot of different stuff coming in, um, either for a hobby or for actually for work and stuff like that. So, let's get to it. But before we continue, I wanna talk to you guys. I brought a sponsor, Rose Gordon Black. Right now, they're having an amazing deal where you can have one of these necklaces for 45% off. Basically, if you click the link down below, you get 30% off our landing page. Everything there's gonna be 30% off but if you do the minimal bar necklace collection or the minimal bar bracelet collection you get an extra 15 percent off so check out rose going black right now they have an amazing deal and they also have the minimal bead bracelets which i love personally just because they're so minimal and they look amazing and this is their new color right now is the tuscany bead which come on it's, it's, it's sexy. I love that blue, that little, you know, salmon color and white, different, all these different colors in it. It just makes it special beat. But, you know, you can't go wrong with one of these necklaces. They have it in silver, they have it in black, they have it in gunmetal, and they all look good and it will complete any of your outfits. So, if you guys are interested in rose gold and black, I'll have the link down below with the promo code so you can get that extra 15% off the minimal bar necklace collection or the minimal bar bracelet collection. Now, let's continue with our video. Let's get into it. So, I have a bunch of boxes here. I have about... I don't even know, 10 packages here. Let's get into it. Um, and one of them, there's something very special in there that I think you guys are gonna like a lot. So let, let's start. Let's start with this box and see what's in here. I really don't know what it's in here. Um, I order these things, you know, sometimes whenever I see it, I just add it to the cart and I go from there. So let's see what it is. Oh, all right, so this, is a dive computer so i i i'm not a diver per se i'm not a diver but i'm getting into spear fishing so and you know you have to go down and i wanted some, a dive computer to be able to monitor all that information for me like how deep i'm going the temperature of the water um when i have to rest when you know when i if basically the the rule of thumb is for every minute that you're down there you rest three minutes to recover so you don't pass out down there so you can you know replenish your oxygen especially for a beginner and i never heard other people say you know for every minute four minutes um and stuff like that so this is the cressy dive computer it's a big it's big it's big it's huge um but the cool thing about this is that it'll tell you everything that's going on very big with very big numbers so you can keep um track of all that and you know you'll you'll be able to see it i mean just compared to my ap next to it you'll see how big it is but you're gonna be underwater so that's that's the whole reason why and this is the cressy leonardo these things um this is the most affordable one this one runs for around 199 bucks which you know it's, it's not bad for all the information that it has because it could save your life um so it's it's not bad at all um other ones they can run up to a thousand dollars for one of these things so i'm glad cressy is a great brand um, it's an italian brand that focuses on diving and free diving and all that so yeah there's the Leonardo. We did a box. Let's do one of these packages here. <laughs> Another spear fishing thing. So when you go spear fishing um, or free diving or diving and all that, you, you need a wetsuit. But I'm in Florida. It's usually hot. And so I just buy a rash guard. And this is one of their Cressy rash guards. And it has and it has this pad right here so you can reload your spear gun. So you can put it on a chest so it doesn't, you know, mess up with your chest. There's a little, you know, small, but there's a pad right there. So it's a rash guard and it's a little like water camouflage so you can basically be undetected underwater. So um, let's see, let's go into another box. Let's, let's do this one. Let's see what we have here. So yeah, when you do spear fishing, free diving, and all that, you can wear a rash guard if it's not cold. Um, if it is cold, then you should wear a wetsuit, but then you have to buy um, weights and all that, so it gets a little bit more complicated. All right, awesome. So this one is a lot of things in one. Um, the first thing here is an EDC flashlight. As you guys know, I love having a flashlight with me at all times, especially when it comes to EDC. Let me see which one this is. Yes, it's the little micro one. Um, super bright apparently. Um, very, very portable as you guys can see. It has a little clip on it so you can always carry it. And I love, it's very clicky. So it's, it's very good when it comes to um, flashlights. And it's an LED. Does it say the lumens on it? I know I got it because it looked very bright on the computer and I know the lumens were pretty high. It just comes in a, this regular box, nothing crazy, but it's, yeah, that's about it. Um, oh, 
This one said, I love having little EDC tools and especially ones that I can blend in with everything else that you got. And this one's perfect because it looks like a key. Great thing, it has a bottle opener, a little flathead screwdriver, a little hex um, bolt wrench and, um, and different sizes here as well. So it's a little key basically. You can carry around like a key. It blends in and whenever you need it, you can use it. And you can probably pry with it, you know, with this thing, uh, but yes, yeah, usually a flathead, and you can use this to open boxes too if you wanted to, like, you see? Um, so, you know, it's sharp, and it's not sharp, it just has a little point, and like I said, it's a little can opener as well. Uh, what is this? Oh, quick spit. This is an anti-fog for your, uh, whenever you go snorkeling or free diving and all that, you spray this inside so your, your uh, face mask doesn't fog. So this is Squid Spit, great reviews. Um, I tried it out once and it was great. So that's why I got a little bottle so I can spray on it just anytime so it doesn't get fogged up. Oh, this was the coolest little knife that I saw uh, online. Look at this. It kind of looks like a Spyderco, if you ask me. It looks like a Spyderco, but it's a little square and it has a little clip. You can use it to open boxes. You know, it's not intimidating because it's small. You just use it to open boxes and packages like that. Um, great little knife, great EDC, and it also has a little hole so you can put a lanyard. Definitely looks like a spider coat, which is pretty cool. Made in China, I don't know. I mean, even the metal, I don't even know what type of metal it uses. Probably something cheap, but it will get the job done. Um, have a little bit more EDC tools here that I found that I was like, oh, let me try these out. This one comes with two. In the picture online, they actually look cooler. They're really not. It looks cheap. It is heavier, but it just looks cheap. It's like that chrome. And it's bottle opener, a little stylus. And this is so you can open the doors. But I think it's just gimmicky because at the end of the day, you can just put that in your, you put that in your uh, pockets or whatever. The germs are there already. It's not like it's antimicrobial or anything like that. But, you know, it looked different online. I don't even, I, I, honestly, I don't even know why I got this. Probably would never get something like this. Because I, to me, it's too gimmicky. Anyways, let's go with this big one. I think I know what it is. I'm not 100% sure but I think you're gonna like it, if it's what I think it is. <laughs> you're going to love this. I'm pretty sure you saw it a little bit already. So these are the Dior's Air Jordans, or the Dior Air Dior's. Look at that. Amazing, these things are sexy. Now, these, I we didn't get them for any of us for to use or anything like that. These, we got them for a giveaway. So this is gonna be given away to, you know, for an essentials giveaway. So you have to keep, you know, stay tuned. Stay tuned, you know, watch our channels, watch our social media so we can give you more details of what has to happen for you to be able to win these. These things cost, right now they're running, retail was about $2,000. Right now they're running for around $16,000. So you can own a pair of $16,000, $17,000 Air Dior's, which look amazing. I'm telling you, just having them right here, they look amazing. They're sexy, sexy shoes. And it comes with everything. It comes with insoles, the bags. Um, so they're brand new. Comes with a Air Dior little keychain, And... Air Jordan little keychain or little tag. Yeah, comes with everything. Laces, you know, the little dust bags and everything. So if you got an interested, like I said, just keep watching our channels so you can know the full details of what you can win. And the box, you can see Air Dior. These things are brand new, brand spanking new. They look amazing. And you can see the price. I don't know if you can see it from there. $2,200, but they're worth $17,000 right now. They only made $85,000, if I'm not wrong. And it tells you, yeah, $85,000. And this is number 2565 that's how amazing we are. So stay tuned for that. Air Dior's coming soon to one lucky winner. What is this? It's a bunch of other little stuff that I bought as well. All right, let's see this first one. Ah, this is a cool little knife that I found. It's a money clip slash knife from Gerber. 
you can never have enough knives, especially for your EDC. Like I said, you use them for different things, to open boxes, to open, you know, um, letters and stuff like that. Uh, open packages like this one. Anyways, this is a little money clip right here, and good thing, this comes with a little protector. So it goes all the way in, it's a little money clip on the side, or you can use it as a little, you know, pocket clip if you want to, which, you know, I wouldn't use it, I would use it actually as a money clip. And then to take it out, you just press, this is a little button right here, and you press it out, and it'll just come out. To put in is a little finicky. But anyways, it goes in, press that button, comes out, you have a little knife, open packages, just see, you put in a little finicky. Other than that, it's pretty cool. Um, yeah, so I like it, Gerber. It's pretty nice little knife they have here. I love having carabiners as well. I think it's something that works, especially if you have a lot of EDC tools or EDC um, looking keys, like the ones I have. It's great to put the carabiners, and this one was a really nice one because it just wasn't just a carabiner. Um, it was a multi-tool as well. First, it looked it looks very nice, and on top of that, it has a bottle opener. You can you never go wrong with having a bottle opener. I think that's pretty cool that anybody you should carry one with a bottle opener. Anyways, has a little carabiner here, and it comes in through here as well, so you can carry things this way. Ooh, wallet. I saw this wallet. A lot of you guys ask for wallets that are not leather and they're durable, and I saw this one from uh, Magpul. If you guys know anything about Magpul, they're a big gun company, and um, like not a gun company, but they do gun accessories, like uh, magazines and stuff like that. And this one, I don't know what it's made of, but it didn't look, it wasn't leather. It doesn't say. But it's like a nylon feeling. And you can put three cards in it. It's made in the US. It's very slim, it's very sleek. And um, yeah, so it's uh, three cards basically. And you can probably put a little bit more, but it just stretch it out. Um, it looks very clean, very sleek. And if you're that tactical type of guy, EDC type of guy, this is a good one to have. It's like a nylon feeling. It looks like it's waterproof probably too. Um, take flight, I don't know what this is. Oh, perfect. I love having pens and I recommend everybody to have pen, but you know, some of you guys don't want to spend, you know, all that money in a pen. You don't have to. You can find a nice pen or a pen that is actually functional and use it as well. This one ran for maybe five bucks, ten bucks, and it has different functionalities. It even comes with a little battery there to put it, but you know, oh, you can see it's a light too. It's a little light. Let's see. There's a glass breaker, you can break some glass. Um, has a little multi-tool here that you can use. This is the pen on this side. So it's, it's a total of four different things. There's a flashlight, the little multi-tool, glass breaker, and a pen. And on top of that, it comes with an extra battery and two extra ink cartridges, just in case you run out of ink. And I love that, look at that. Last thing, um, perfect. So I also like carrying, uh, lighters with me just because really I don't smoke but just in case I need to um, start a fire or something like that and I saw this little case and I thought it was cool you can put little zippo inserts in it and it makes it it's like a plastic uh, kydex type thing and it comes with a little clip so you can carry them and then you just open it and you just turn on the little zippo lighters and you can use zippo fluids or you can use the thunderbolt uh, thunderbird single torch lighters if you want that or the uh, Z Plus Extreme and then the Zippo Fluid ones, but it doesn't work with the Zippo Butane or Arc Lighters. But you know, you have that and it makes it more rugged than the metal ones. Just makes it look different in my opinion. Pretty cool. All right, so we have a few more packages here. Um, let's open this one and see what this is. A few more multi-tools or two more things here. Uh, this was another multi-tool I saw from SOG, which they make amazing multi-tools. Let me open this. Amazing little multi-tool. So this one here has a lot of different hex and little, basically, flatheads, if you wanna use it as a flathead. Has a Phillips here, flathead here. Has a little prior, another hex, a little bottle opener. And it just, it's pretty cool. So it has, it even comes with different sizes, as you can see right there. And it looks like a little 
army skull or whatever, which is pretty cool, very small, very compact, and you can put it on the carabiner if you want to carry it around with different other multi-tools that have different functionalities, and you can carry it. So it has a 1 4 wrench, 5 16 wrench, 3 8 wrench, um, large flathead screwdriver, uh, carbide, sh oh, no, it's a sharpener. I don't know if you can see this little thing right here, little gray thing, that's a sharpener. Bottle opener, Phillips screw, um, screwdriver, one fourth hex bit drive, uh, nail puller, like a little pry bar, flathead screwdriver, and oh, this side right here is a little cord cutter or cable cutter. And let's see. All right, so this. It's another wallet uh, for the people that have been asking for wallets. Um, this one's from Belroy. Now this one, um, they have different colors. They have brown, black, blue, I think, if I'm not wrong. And the cool thing about it is you can put your cards in here, and then it has this little strap that you just pull up, and you can put the cards in here. And on top of that, it has a slit in the front and a slit in the back if you want to put a little cash or another card, and then all your cards in the middle, and you just have access and then the as soon as you put the cards back in this little strap goes back in as you guys can see very nice wallet from Belroy. Belroy makes some amazing amazing products that are really affordable um, compared to other goods they're well made and um, yeah you can find them off of Amazon at a very good price next package I have two more packages here let's see what is this all right so these are the bottoms of my rash guard I already have one, but I wanted a different color as well. Same brand, Cressy, and it has like little knee pads and you know little thing, foot things, so you can so they don't rise up from your legs and and it's just to keep you protected. Um, the whole reason for rash guards is first to protect you from the sun, uh, protect you from the cold, um, or wetsuits, you know, in general, it's to protect you from the sun, protect you from the cold, and. On top of that, you know, especially wetsuits because there are thicker rash guards don't protect you as much for that. Um, if there's any jellyfish and stuff like that, it will protect you from them as well if you, you know, get stung. That's why whenever you go spearfishing or diving, you wear gloves, you wear, you know, a wetsuit, a full body wetsuit or a rash guard to protect you from the environment because, you know, you could get hurt. Um, and then finally this one. And I now that I open everything, I'm only missing something like I said I'm getting I'm getting into spear fishing so I had to get my own fins these are the uh, Cressy Gara 3000s um, they're cheap they're 100 bucks um, they're nothing comparable to the carbon fiber that run for five six hundred bucks like I said I'm a beginner and starting off so I wanted something affordable and I didn't want to use somebody else's uh, I did use it the first few times and you know it just I want my own you know I had to give them back every time I'm done um, with these I can keep them in my bag because I have a whole setup I have my spear gun a backpack with all my stuff in there and then all I was missing it was my own fins um, so I got them I went ahead because I was debating between getting carbon fiber or these plastic ones for beginners they recommend these plastic ones just to get used to it carbon fiber are sometimes are too soft I guess they say um, so they say you know just use regular cheap ones basically quote unquote they're a hundred bucks um, and then you can move up to the more expensive ones after you're more familiar with everything um, so yeah so that's my new little hobby so I'm, I'm a lot of the stuff was related to that and a lot of EDC stuff and definitely that giveaway that we're doing which is going to be insane so I hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know what you think let me know if you wanted me to do more unboxings like that because I always get packages you know I always look at I buy stuff either for hobby or to do giveaways or um, you know just EDC stuff that I like buying or tech stuff that I like buying as well so let me know if you're interested in those unboxing videos and I can do more because I always get a lot of packages every week um, let me know what you think leave a comment down below and I'll see you guys next time honestly I don't know who the fuck to trust you see my friend or my fault I'm a